match the name of each 3D shape to its number of vertices. Well, first of all, you need to know what vertices are. Vertices is the mathematical name for corners. Okay, now if you didn't know that, you'd struggle on this question. So it's really important going into this test, you know what vertices, edges and faces are for 3D shapes. The other thing is, is that I've actually put these pictures in. These won't be given on the actual paper. And why does that make it tricky? It's because you kind of have to have remembered how many vertices 3D shapes have, or you kind of have to visualize it in your mind. Now with the pictures, it becomes a lot easier, but I've added these in so you can see. For example, a cube has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight vertices. So that would be there. Square based pyramid is a pyramid with a square base. That's this one. And it has one, two, three, four, five. So square base pyramid has five vertices. An octagonal base pyramid is a pyramid with an octagonal base, which is this. Now that means there are eight corners down here and one up here, making it nine. And this one's tricky because if you don't re read it carefully, you might say triangular based pyramid, but actually it says triangular based prism. Now, I just know that as a triangular prism, and it has six corners, so that would go here. One, one, two, three, four, five, six. So you can see how this question becomes a lot easier when you have the pictures, but you wouldn't have them in the test. So either you need to remember how many corners and faces and edges these kind of 3D shapes have, or you need to see a picture of them in your mind, which is a little bit more tricky.